In this video, I will provide two examples. I will explain how Venn diagrams can be used to solve some problems. First one, the sample is space and two major events A and B are given. Now, how do we draw a Venn diagram for this example? Since there are two major events, we need a Venn diagram with two circles. The circles represent the events and the rectangle represents the sample space. First, we need to consider the common region. Common region means common elements for both A and B. We know 3 and 6 are common to both A and B. Therefore, 3 and 6 must be in the common region. Now we can consider events separately. First A. We know 3 and 6 are already in A. Therefore, 0 to 8 should be in the region only A. Similarly, consider the B. 3 and 6 are in B. Therefore, 1, 5, 7, 9 should be in the region only B. Are we done? Not yet. We consider events A and B separately, but now we have to go to the sample space. Yes, now you see all the elements are in S but 4. Therefore, 4 must be outside of the circles. This is the Venn diagram for this example. Now let me use this Venn diagram to answer some questions. First, A intersection B. Or we can say A and B. What is the A intersection B? The common elements. What are the common elements? 3 and 6. Therefore, we can write uh, in set notation 3 comma 6. That is the A intersection B. Then go to the A union B. Or we can say A O B. That means all elements in A and in B and the common region. Or I can say the all elements in only A region and only B region and in the common region. So you know we have these elements in A and B. So that is the A union B. Then how do we find the A complement? Yes, A complement is every elements in S but A. Therefore, let me remove A. So, what are the elements? Now, you see 1, 5, 7, 9, 4. Yes, that is the A complement. How about the next? Next is to find the A intersection B complement. Okay, how do we find this? First, we need to understand A intersection B. We already know A intersection B, but let me show you, this is the A intersection B. But we need the complement of that. Therefore, we can remove it. So, what are the elements now? We have 1, 0, 1, 2, 4, 5, 7, 8, 9. That is the A intersection B complement. Now, let me consider A union B complement. Okay, first we need to understand the A union B. What is the A union B? This. Right? So, how do we find the complement? Complement is the outside of this region. Only 4. So, that is the A union B complement. Now, let me explain another example. Again, the sample is space and two events are given. Now, how do we draw a Venn diagram for this case? First, we need to understand there are two major events, A and B. And next, do we have any common elements? No, there are no any common elements. Therefore, we know A and B are disjoint. So then, this is the Venn diagram for that. Now we can go to A, right? Then go to the B, then we have to go to the sample space. So you see, all the elements are in S already, but 2 and 9. 2 and 9 should be out of the circles. 